Seems no matter how much planning you do, or how safety conscious you are, something always goes wrong. I had this fishing boat mounted on top of my car there, and she was solid. I had put a roll and a half of duct tape into the job. So I'm driving along, and up comes the wind, bam, she's out of there. Well, it's not my fault. I didn't actually aim the boat at that hitchhiker. It was an accident. You should have heard the string of obscenities. As far as I'm concerned, a woman that age shouldn't be hitchhiking in the first place. But I'm thinking this whole roof rack concept needs a little bit of re-engineering, eh? Wouldn't it be a lot safer and more aerodynamic if you could put stuff under the car instead of over it? But as the fat guy said to the phone booth, we need a little more clearance. <laughs> Next step's real easy. Uh, what you need is four of these great big tractor tires. Not that hard to come by. There's abandoned tractors all over this country, thanks to the government trade policies, and people prefer to eat food made from vinyl. Okay, Lee, uh, I got a bit of a challenge here. The tractor wheel not actually made to mount right onto the car hub. I got the rim off, took the tire off that, and the rim fits on there fine, but I don't want the rim on there. I want I want the tractor wheel on there. So what I need to do is to mount the tractor wheel onto the rim with some kind of an adapter. Now, if you call up your local auto supply and tell them you're looking for an adapter to put tractor wheels onto a 1990 Honda, well, there's going to be some laughter, probably a visit from the cops, maybe a psychiatric nurse. So instead, might I recommend the handyman secret adapter, duct tape. Starting to get the idea now, aren't you? Now all I have to do is slide the boat underneath there, and I'll be able to carry it safely and easily to my predetermined destination. It's not a tractor trailer, it's a tractor and a trailer. And it's just that simple. So remember, women don't find you handsome, they should at least find you handy. Oh, I almost forgot, there's another bonus to this unit. I've actually added paddles to the drive wheels on her. So it's not just a boat carrier, it's an amphibious car. Hey, Red Green here. If you've ever wanted to see me live, or see if I still was alive, I'm doing a brand new one-man show, and this could be it. In fact, I'm calling the tour. This could be it. I'll be doing a U.S. tour in the spring and Canada in the fall. It's a 90-minute family-friendly live lodge meeting. To find out where I'm going to be and when I'm going to be there, go to redgreen.com and follow the links. Hopefully, I will see you on the road. Meanwhile, keep your stick on the ice.